everyone, it's Miss Dragonfly back again and today we are going to discuss how your partner treats you when you are ill. Don't forget to like, share this video and subscribe to the channel so my videos can reach more people. Now when a person is sick, they are often vulnerable and in need of care and support and how a partner responds to their spouse's illness can be telling of their level of love and concern for them. A partner who is caring and attentive when their spouse is ill is likely to demonstrate their love and affection for them. And this may involve taking time off work or other responsibilities to care for their sick partner, running errands for them or simply being present to provide emotional support. On the other hand, a partner who is indifferent or neglectful when their spouse is sick may not have the same level of love and concern for their well-being. And this type of behaviour can be hurtful and can create feelings of resentment or lack of connection in the relationship. If a wife becomes frustrated or angry when her husband is sick, it could be a sign that she does not have as much emotional investment in the relationship. She may not be as patient or understanding and may not go out of her way to help him feel better. This type of behaviour can be hurtful and make the person who is sick feel even worse being in that situation. A case in point is just imagine you have suffered some health condition like a heart attack or a stroke. Would she look after you during this time you spent recovering? Like cook all the meals and help dress and bathe you? If she doesn't work, will she step up and start working to bring in some money when you are unable to and keep you both afloat? The income doesn't have to be as much as you would have brought in, but at least something to keep you both going while you recover. And just like if you had your right hand, then your left hand would have stepped up and taken over the duties while your right hand recovered. Otherwise, you won't be able to do anything or get anything done. You'll be completely helpless. Your left hand won't be as efficient or as good as the right hand at doing the task, but it doesn't need to be. Only do what is needed to get by until the right hand recovers and can resume its role as a dominant hand again. You may even be able to see an indication of how she will behave and her true feelings for you before you marry by observing how she acts and treats you before you marry. A case in point is Andrew and Sarah went holidaying in the Philippines. Andrew got food poisoning and was throwing up constantly in the hotel room and was feeling seriously sick. He didn't want to go to the hospital there as he didn't have confidence in the hospital system there. So just stayed in the hotel room hoping he will recover on his own. Sarah wasn't going to let Andrew's illness get in the way of her holiday. So she left him in the hotel room by himself throwing up and went shopping instead. If you were so ill like Andrew was, you would want and need to be looked after as you were not in a position to look after yourself. However, if your partner left as you were not fun and left you to seek her own entertainment instead, how would you feel? When you are this ill, normally a loving partner would be beside themselves with concern and look after you until you were at least feeling well enough to look after yourself. However, this case clearly shows that Sarah did not actually love Andrew and she has showed herself to, to be selfish. This would be a clear signal not to marry someone like Sarah as she would not be there for you when you actually need her, the time when you actually need a partner. So in conclusion, how a partner treats their spouse when they are ill can be a good indication of their feelings towards them. A loving and caring partner will go above and beyond to support their spouse during times of illness, while a neglectful or indifferent partner may not prioritize their well-being in the same way. When this happens, it is a major it's a red flag and shows you absolutely should not marry her if you want a caring partner and one that's a team player and also alludes to her lack of loyalty as well. So those are my thoughts on the matter. What do you think? And have you been in the situation where you were ill and your partner just did not care, went on their, her, her own way, or were you one of the lucky ones that got a partner to sit there and nurse you while you were ill? So let us know by leaving your comments below. And if you've enjoyed the video, then don't forget to like, share, and subscribe as it will help me out a lot. And for more info on choosing the right partner, check out this video.
Well, that's all for this segment. And until I see you next, remember to stay strong, confident, and awesome.